What's up everybody? It's Andrew Love here, my second last message ever. Uh, and today I want to talk about change again, but this time is we need to change the way the world sees God by the way that we are. And I've touched on this before, but it's very present right now in Africa and Nigeria. There's this problem with extremists pretending like they're hearing voices from God and they're hurting people and they're doing all sorts of things, but they're detracting people from religion like crazy and I know that there's so many people that do this and they make this vehicle which is called religion which is meant to bring people closer to God and they're using it to detract people from God altogether and we have to understand that everything we do is a reflection of our belief system so our belief system has to lead us to being better people right so I have a quote here from the divine principle and it says God gave human beings a portion of responsibility as the condition based on which he could love them more than any other being in creation. God's intention in giving this condition was to make them worthy to be lords of creation by having them take after his creative nature. So because we have that portion of responsibility, then God can love us more because we have the choice to act well or to act crazily. And I'm... Oh my God, I wasted so much time in my life just being preoccupied with stuff that had nothing of any value because I had no example, no paradigm of a religious person who had their life together. It was only until I hit 27 years old, until I met people from the Unification Church that could show me that there was a better way by example. So please understand, by example is the key here. So if we want people to be attracted to God and to true parents, we have to show them that we have a better way by our lives, by our example. This is paramount. This is the top of the food chain of importance. So please make sure that everything you do, every word that you speak, every communication that you have represents God and true parents, our heavenly parent and true parents, and that every person you talk to, you leave them feeling better. You should have a goal that every time you speak to somebody, you walk away and they feel better than when they did before they spoke to you. So please do this all day, every day, fight for this. And if you do this a little by little, the difference between someone who's massively successful and someone who's massively unsuccessful is this incremental work, this little stuff that they're doing every day. And you'll notice they start to be a world apart after a year, two years of just putting in a little effort every day it adds to a whole lifetime of change. So God bless you, have a great week, and I'll see you next week for my last message with Pastor Tanya Edwards, okay?